What's up, my AMC fam? It's your boy Mike coming at you from. You already know AMC Movie Theater is here to Mecca, California. Okay, this is not financial advice. This is my own personal opinion. It is Thursday. It's about 210 here on the West Coast. AMC is trading about $35. And usually I make my videos about 15 feet that way, but it's hot. So I'm in the shade leaning against my car. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, I did get my lettuce cut. My barber's back and he hooked me up. So thank you very much. Shout out to my barber. Um, I needed that cut. I was looking like a grizzly bear. Um, okay, now this is what we got going on for AMC. Also in Robinhood because they both uh, tie together. Now, I got a lot of feedback regarding Robinhood from my video yesterday, talking about if you own shares in Robinhood and they go belly up, your shares are insured. But if you have crypto and they go belly up, you lose your crypto. Okay, a couple of things that I wanna also share with you is that transfers out of Robinhood are taking a long time. Um, for the better part of the month, I've been talking to a couple of people, about two dozen people uh, regarding the transfers. It's taking anywhere from eight to nine days up to three weeks. And some of those transfers are not getting completed. Now, if they're not getting completed, what is the problem? Well, we know that there's billions and billions of synthetic shares out uh, in the market and that we own the float multiple times over. So there's no shares available to buy. Maybe that's the reason, or it could be a huge reason why that when your transfer goes out of Robinhood, they never bought your shares to begin with. So they got to go out, buy the shares, find your, let's say, 100 shares. But they only find 50 or 70 or 40 or 30, and they can't complete your order. So they cancel your order and you're still back in Robinhood. Okay. So you need to be very careful. Now, I don't have anything in Hood. I use them because I like the, the ease of their app. It's a good app. It's easy to um, get around and navigate, and that's pretty much it. But I have nothing in Robinhood. I can't tell you what brokerage to use. I'm not promoting any other brokerage, but you need to be very careful. Now, if you want to continue to use Robinhood, that's totally fine. But I want everybody that's in Robinhood to pay very close attention to what I'm about to tell you, okay? Pay for order flow with Robinhood is a vast majority of their income and their money. If they ever lose that or if that gets suspended in any way, shape, or form, they're going to plummet fast. And about 95%, 90-95%, something crazy, they will just drop if that ever gets suspended or if they lose that. And what's going to happen when your money is in there? Who knows? Crypto, you know, they might be under maintenance for the duration. Um, you might be able to sell your shares. Uh, I, I have no idea. They're not in it for you. Then your best interest is not theirs. They're just in it for themselves. And they'll screw you over in order to preserve whatever they have now. Again, this is just my opinion. It's not financial advice. Now, they, they're they supposed to have um, around earnings and, and they're supposed to mention, people keep saying that they're gonna accept Shiba. Robinhood never did. And also the crypto wallets never came out. Okay, it's not coming out this year. And um, I think the fourth quarter for them looks like even more disastrous. So now what I wanna share some thoughts with you is that AMC, we already accept Dogecoin. What if we start accepting Shiba? Okay, that'd be pretty great because now we have two coins that people are just loving. Uh, the people's coin you know we have shiba and dogecoin if they start accepting that amc it'll be nice now i know that amc is going to address something about the business model coming up what is it i do not know but i do know that they're talks in with the nfl maybe it's that uh, i hear some rumors about a deal with netflix not a merger just a deal and i'm not trying to spread any rumors or nothing like that but it's just what i read at a couple of places it's not fact it's just rumors that they might have a deal with Netflix. Again, I don't know what it is. Uh, it could be neither of those. It, it could be entirely something different. But if they're working on the business model, become a profitable company, just not by the way of movies, you should be excited about that, okay? Now, upon that, I know earnings is coming up um, within like the next week. I don't know the exact date. So if you know the exact date, please leave it in the comments, let me know. Well, earnings coming up, they announce a different type of business model it, and earnings blows it out the water, a nice business model. You know, we have a, a great movement to the upside. We have a short uh, thesis behind us, you know, cause it's still being heavily manipulated and we start pushing up on our own without any FOMO or anything else. It'll be absolutely amazing. There's no reason why, you, you know, you can't hold AMC. Now, and remember, AMC's for the long haul. I tell you, don't play options, okay? Now, I'm gonna explain something really quick. I told you I'll be transparent. I did buy two options. I bought options for the middle of December, okay? I bought two of them. They're already in the money at the $35 strike price. The reason why is because yes, I did buy those. I do see us moving up quite a bit, but I wanna keep that price there because I'm gonna use the other money for other things, the money that I have for other things. Now, tomorrow, I'm also gonna buy two more options. Those will be for January 21st for that big day, okay? I'm gonna, those are also gonna be probably at the 35 or $36 strike price, and those I will exercise as well. And then I'm gonna buy one more, it will be in February. As to date in February, it will probably be the backside of February. Um, Maybe the monthly, yeah, I'm not too sure. Uh, I gotta look at that, but that's what uh, that's what my plan is. That's what I'm gonna be doing. Now, I pay the extra premium. It is expensive, but then again, all five options I will be exercising and adding my, to my position. So I just wanna let you know, I'm gonna buy them tomorrow. I'll also tweet that out when I buy those tomorrow, the two options, okay. 
So again, playing the weekly options is, uh, is a dangerous game. Okay, I don't know what's gonna happen you know, tomorrow or on Monday. I, I don't know what's out there, but there's a lot of things going on, a lot of rumors, and I'm just excited for it. And just being patient, patient and having uh, patience and perseverance is the way to go. Being long at MC, AMC is the way to go. So if you like this video, you know, I know you do. Leave me a comment. If you like my haircut, leave me a comment. If you just want to say what's up, <laughs> leave me a comment. Okay, like and subscribe. Thank you for your time. I'll see you in the next one. This might be my longest video. I don't know yet. Peace.